Okay, folks, the ASCO Lighting Company reached out to us and asked us to test their LED under cabinet lighting motion sensor 50 by 50 series. That's the box that it came in. And they packed it real nice, but we have unpacked it. And here's the lights. And in a little bit, we're going to install them. And I would also like to mention that they are providing a 50% code, 50% off code that we'll put down below in the description box for you all to use if you buy these lights. Okay, so we're going to start setting this up, and they provide these uh, tape with metal. Um, 3M makes them, and then you attach it with the magnets on the bottom of the lights. So Kathy is going to start the demonstration, I guess. <laughs> you know, we did some prep work because um, there's things you have to do and wait. We cleaned underneath the cabinet, which is where we thought would be a good place for the lights. And we put the stickers up yesterday because it takes 24 hours to dry before you can hang the lights on it. So we went ahead and did that. And um, if you don't want them to fall, you have to wait 24 hours. So that's what we did. This tape is actually a magnet on one side. There's metal dots on the bar that will hold this up to the magnet. And also, you have to charge them for three to four hours before you use them. So we did that yesterday. These charging cords, the directions say it's perfectly safe to leave them on the light if you want. I may take them off later, but for now I'm leaving them on. It's a good way not to lose a cord if you're always misplacing your cords. So let's stick them up there and see what happens. So these are supposed to be, um, they can be either automatic or you turn the switch to auto and then it'll turn off and on on its own or you can just turn it to on and it'll just be on until you turn it off. So it's that and easy. You can see that they're Nice and bright. bright. They laid up the sink you can see the that well for us. Sinks. Okay, and we'll put this one on on. They're going to stay lit for a few minutes, and then it should switch off, and the other one should just stay on. But as you can see, very simple to do. Um, even Dan and I <laughs> are able to install these lights. Uh, they would be really nice even though they're called under cabinet lighting. Mommy under cabinet lighting. So even though they're for under the cabinet, I thought it would be really nice for in a closet or uh, a shed or anywhere where you didn't have regular lighting. Uh, if you were going to use them in a shed, though, um, you have to be living in an area where the temperature doesn't go below 14 degrees. So we could put it in our shed. We're in negative 20s sometimes. And <laughs> you can't put it on brick? Yeah, you can't put it on a rough surface like um, bricks, or they gave some uh, examples, but... Uh, stucco, things like that. has to be smooth surface, like plaster or wood or, you know, anything smooth. So keep that in mind. But um, it's very bright, and I really yes. like that. It really um, brightens up that area there. I had a light here, which is so difficult for me because uh, to take the cover off, my hands aren't strong enough. So this will be really nice. Yes. I, I haven't had a light in there for 
years. And what's nice is these are, you charge them, so is there, does it say late time or? We're expecting them to last quite a while. And as I said, if you, we really recommend them. If you'd like to buy them, there is a code in the description box um, for 50% off and a oh. link. I missed this part when I read the directions. But um, after turning the light on, just tap the touch sensor to choose light color. Uh, there oh, there. Uh, okay. Let's see if I can. And that dimmed that it. Dimmed it. I guess that is the only option. A dimmer light or it says colors. Okay. I thought it was. And then that, I hit it again. And Kathy's dimming the yellow, and I I like the white, the brighter white. I think. Yeah, it's more like a dimming than anything else. So kind of like mood lighting. <laughs> but I, I think they're cool. Yes. I like them. Um, I really don't need colors under my cabinet anyway. Yeah, the, but if you need the colors or like the col different colors, you know, that would be fine for you. As we said, we'll probably just use the white. And we'd like to thank the company for reaching out to us and giving us these free lights, which will get plenty of use from us. And as I said, we recommend it. And the link and the code for 50% off will be in the description box. We give these lights. Thumbs up. <laughs> which, please give this video a thumbs up because it'll help get it out it'll help this company and it'll help us out you all have a great day god bless